Well, hello, folks out there in YouTube land. Got a big show lined up for you. Let's get right on into it. All right, we're going to pull up this screen. Two cover corners for the Vols. And man, I'm going to tell you what, these would be two quality guys that we could really use. And I think it's time to <laughs> discuss this. Look, let's look at our number one need for the Vols, and that's cover corners. The one thing that killed us last year, I mean, just killed us in most of the games that we uh, struggled in, was our inability to cover wide receivers. It was at times a disaster. We could really use these two guys, and they're available. They're available for us to get. And this is a story uh, talking about how the Vols are very interested in this four-star cornerback. It talks about how the Vols were 125th in pass defense last season, which is atrocious. And uh, the player's J.Q. Hardaway out of Cincinnati. And it says, according to 247, uh, Hardaway has interest uh, from pretty much every DB needy team in the, in the country. And obviously, we're one of them. Tennessee, Auburn, Kentucky, the Wisconsin staff, et cetera. It says the former uh, head coach Luke Fickle would obviously love to have him back as well. School to watch out for is Ohio State, et cetera. And here's the player, uh, J.Q. Hardaway. He's in terrible shape, as you can tell. <laughs> He must work out. And Hardaway was actually recruited by Tennessee before he uh, uh, before he went to Cincinnati. So he's been to UT a bunch, and he knows the deal. And we came close to getting him, is my understanding. And if he wants to play in the SEC, you know, this would be a great spot for him. So if he's out there and if he's listening, dude, this is where you ought to come and play because I can tell you right now, you'll get on that field a lot quicker than somewhere else. You know, you've got a great opportunity here. And uh, look, we, we need players. We need cornerbacks, something awful. Now, we've got some good ones coming in, but they're going to be freshmen. And uh, some good depth and, and a very experienced cornerback would be great. We need two. So let's look at the other guy. And that's Fentrell Cypress the second. said, while Tennessee's attack was one of the most prolific in the country, its defense could use some work. The volunteers allowed two, and we know, okay, top, yeah, blah, blah, blah. We're terrible at defense says the Vols' top defensive back won't return in 2023, and that's Trayvon Flowers. And he, and he actually played well. It says says, uh, Fentrell Cypress is one of the best cornerbacks available in the portal. He recorded 39 tackles, 28 solos, fumble recovery, etc. Plenty of pass deflections on 40 targets. And he only allowed 18 catches last year. So, I mean, he was very good. He was all SEC second team says he would be an immediate contributor for the volunteers tennessee secondary could get significantly better especially if we pick up the other fellow if we could pick up both those guys man i'd feel so much better about our defense this uh, article actually talks about how we need obviously we need a wide receiver Ra Ra thomas is probably our second need and uh, we've got a lot of interest in him and i know they're trying to uh, trying to get him as well and this one actually talks about hudson card of texas says with Hendon Hooker leaving for the NFL and then uh, Joe Milton being a super senior, et cetera. I said, of course, with Nico coming in, it's really hard to say, but it would be nice to have another experienced quarterback. Now, I don't know if Hudson Card's the right guy for us. I'd rather, if we're going to bring somebody in, be a fifth-year senior type guy that has like one year left because I think Nico or Jackson is probably going to take over at some point, possibly even uh, middle or late of next year. Who knows? You know, it might be Joe Milton. It might be some – experienced quarterback we bring in it's really hard to say but i know what we do need for sure are cornerbacks and those two guys would be awesome for us to get i'm just saying it like it is they need to go get those two guys just go get them and be done with it and then we can focus on all of our other needs but those that's our biggest need go get them they're available and we have nil money and let's just let's make this happen it's not like they're all americans they're not going to cost a fortune so i would go get them because we need them all right, folks, that's just a quick video on, uh, obviously, our biggest need. And uh, I sure would like to see these two guys get picked up by the Vols. I think that would really sure us up in the defense. And I think we're in pretty darn good shape on the defensive line. And, man, we've got some good players coming in. But they're all going to be freshmen. And I just – it's hard not to be concerned about freshmen. They're just – you know, it's tough for them to get out there and really compete in the SEC. But picking up some experienced, uh, successful uh, defensive players would be, would be great. And if you like this content, be sure to hit that like button. Let's me know to continue to cover the Vols. And if you haven't subscribed to that subscribe button, I'd appreciate it. And we'll see you next time on Sports Talk Jay.